Enough page for this uh, product management system project. So let's begin. So I have come to my new terminal. Uh, I'll create a new component ng g4 generate c4 component uh, login login product and do so login product component has been created now i'll do a sign up sign up product okay both are created and now i'll go to my app routing model.ts yeah uh, let me give the paths path login product that will component will be login component next path i'll give sign up sign up product component will be sign up component let me check login product Yes, we can see login product works. And this will be sign up. First, I'll be doing the sign up. Uh, so I have come to the view product, same HTML I'll copy. Not view product, add product HTML I'll copy. inside the sign up CSS I'll copy put inside this sign up and save uh, we require only two fields for sign up we require one is email password name and city this I'll change to email email and this will be enter email ID here I'll make email email I'll keep and here I'll give sign up sign up product sign up product dot form sign up create sign up in component.ts parameter in lq data and we save save this heading I'll make sign up this 
email here it will be password 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 and keep this three I don't need so many uh, I'll be changing it to the name and city replicate another one and this will be name type will be text This will be name. Name and that you are name and key. and this will be city 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 text Okay, here only sign up should be there. This will remove. Let it be sign up. I'll go to my db.json first. Replace this with sign up. Uh, remove this default one and save. Okay, sign up has come. So we will be doing the API now. I will go to my API service.ts and here I will be doing sign up. Sign up. data for time we will keep any so return this dot http dot post I'll take copy this API paste it and pass in the data and save uh, instead of this any I will go to the model uh, where we have product model ts uh, export sign up export um, class sign up so email will be string password string city and name city will be also type of string Another one is name. String. 
Replace with sign up. So sign up code auto inputted here. We'll save. Come to my sign up component dot ts. So here private API API service. We have to subscribe the data dot subscribe the response console and see the response as well. So let me check. Email I'll give test at gmail.com password test123 name test city my and I'll sign up. As we can see in our console data has come and if I refresh this we can see data has been saving so sign up has been working we are getting successfully sign up after sign up i have to redirect to login page before that i have to do something like um, yes it'll take a p tag already we have So we have to make use of slash and I have taken anchor tag. So if I click you can see it goes to login page. And after sign up also I have to go for login page as well. And this I will do in component.ts this dot route dot navigate. It is login product. We'll save it. So let me try once again. Test to test testing city. After sign up, I am going to login page and the response is also getting saved. So now I will do the login page. So, okay, I will close all this. Copy the same thing. Paste it here. Login. 
Pero soy el otro login. El component.ts login data type any let's say we both so we'll be copying the CSS of this as well control e and I'll paste it here so we need only email and password the style remove can see uh, yeah, heading also will change that will be your login uh, don't have account then login this also will change don't have account click here to sign up and I'll save request to login this got changed now route side change to sign up product yes so again I'll go to the, my API so this is for login so if response is right that time we have to login so i'll create a function user login so i'll take data of type any this dot http dot uh, return and write right? uh, return this dot http dot get because we are not posting now we have to get it we have to match it let me make use of template literal so I am making use of template literals uh, so um, let me copy this path paste it here and try to match email equals to data dot email password equals to data dot password so another parameter I'll take that is observe take endless forms and I have to subscribe this whole thing so I'll come to next line dot subscribe value I'll take type any so I'll console dot log value I'll go to my API uh, login component.ts general view private API API service so here this dot API dot user login data let me see so I'll inspect we go test test ok 
can see values are coming now I have to like match the length so length is 0 you can see body dot length is 0 and values are perfect item length should be 1 and for right values length should be 1 test 1 2 2 3 paste it test 1 2 2 3 for this response I'll see body yes length is 1 when length is 1 it should get past that we will be doing I'll go back to my code and go to the API so if value dot body dot length equals to equals to 1 that time I have to re redirect it to the view product this dot um, okay another thing I have to do private router router yes router what not imported so this dot router dot navigate so it should navigate to view product if values are right if values are wrong and else part I'll keep a alert credentials not found credentials so let me try First, I'll try with wrong with you can see credentials not found so now with the right values I'll try we're getting some error let me check yes uh, routing error we are getting you dot product I made instead of view weapon product now again password is already copied so this I'll copy paste it yes when it's right we are redirected to the view product details page so our sign up and login is working so thanks for watching this video thank you